We interrupt our program to bring you this important message. One kiss is all it takes. Falling in love with me. Possibilities and it's like all you need. Mm -hmm. I haven't filmed in so long, but I'm back. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I need to do a lip scrub because my lips are so dry now. You know, shout out to Elle because her lip scrubs are bomb. And don't mind my face, I'm so red. I was just outside tanning all afternoon. Ah, like, okay, let me show you how burned my legs are. Ooh, you see this? That burn? Oh my God. God damn. I took a long break, but now I'm back. <laughs> Today I'm going to be doing a natural summer look because it is finally summertime in Canada, you know? Okay, so I'm gonna start by prepping my face. I like using sprays as a start. So this is one you can get from like Winters or Marshalls and it's um, so it's a hydrating face mist and this one is Coconut Rose. So we're gonna spray that all over my face. <coughs> one in my mouth. Since you know it's summertime, we want to moisturize our face. I'm gonna go in with the Dr. Jart Water Fuse Lotion. It's like a gel consistency. And I'm gonna rub that all over my face. My red face. And I'm gonna do some eye cream to brighten my eyes. Cause you know, summertime you wanna look nice and glowy. You wanna be gentle around the eyes. Now I'm gonna go in with some sunscreen. I like to use this, this Pericone MD. I think I'm saying that right. Photoplasma Broad Spectrum SPF 30. So it's like a little orange cream consistency. Can you see? Put spots all over my face. I'm gonna get a bit more and then blend that in. Well, I mean rub it in, not blend it in, but you know what I mean? So I'm gonna go with the YSL Blur Primer. And it has these like gel sparkles in it. Well, you can see it from the bottle better. See that? So it comes out. Oh, I thought I broke it, but it's good, it's good. Okay, we're good. I forgot how clumsy I am when it comes to doing makeup. Well, filming makeup. I legit look like a tomato. For foundation, since I got a little color going on, you know, no more Casper the Ghost. I'm gonna go in with the Wet n Wild Photo Focus Foundation. It has like a little spatula so you can just plop it on your face. I'm gonna grab a brush and now blend it in. I like to pat it into my skin. I'm gonna make a really dewy, summery, natural look today. I haven't filmed in so long and I don't even know why. I just got so busy and uh, things fell off, but don't you worry, I am back now. Back and I'm better, you know? Yeah, great. Making jokes to myself. <laughs> I tend to do that a lot. I laugh at my own jokes because I think I'm hilarious. People might disagree, but I think I'm freaking hilarious. Now I'm done with my foundation. I'm gonna go into concealer. So today I'm gonna be using the Tarte Shape Tape. The only thing about mine is like, I had to get it online and it's kind of late for me, but I'll make it work. I'm taking this concealer brush from e.l.f. and blending it out. I just take the excess of the brush and go under my brows kind of give it some coverage. Eyes, I just like to tap it in to cover those dark circles because man's only sleep four hours a night. No, like five hours a night, which is not good. That's why we use concealer to cover it up. Now I'm gonna quickly do the other eye. So you can kind of see it's so bright and that the concealer is too bright for me, but I'm gonna make it work. Do what I gotta do. Okay, so now I'm using the Fenty matchstick and amber and I'm gonna contour up my face a bit because you know we still want that sharp lines forehead and the sides of my nose and my chin to get rid of that double chin and then I'm just gonna take a blending brush you know Loki I'm still Casper the Ghost because it's my first day tanning so we gotta bronze myself up Loki I think my nose is burned so makeup is not sticking on to it. Now I'm gonna go in with the Ciate London Dewy Stick and make myself a little dewy. Cause you know, a summertime look is all about that dewiness. 
So the areas like I would highlight, I'm gonna make myself a little dewy. I'm gonna call this a, a dewy, a dewy look. Low key, first time attempting a dewy look because it used to be super, 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 super oily. So it call me dewy naturally, but this time my skin's more dry. So we gotta build that dewiness. See, dewy dewy. So tips on taming your baby hair is grab your mascara gel or eyebrow gel and brush those bad boys down. This is the Essence, Essence Lash and Brow Gel. Tames those baby hairs down and you don't look crazy anymore. Wow, clap clap for me. I'm so weird. <laughs> okay, so now I'm gonna powder the areas that I didn't um, put the dewy stick on. So around my cheeks to kind of set it and make everything blend. I low-key learned this trick on Emily She was saying, why would you put powder on your highlight areas? Cause that just covers the highlight. So I leave it alone and then I put highlight over that. So now I'm gonna put some color into my face. It's summertime, I wanna look cute, you know, with the blossom cheeks, with the glowy cheeks, the pink blushy cheeks. So I'm gonna use this tart Blush Bliss Blush Blush Oh, that's hard. Blush Bliss Blush Palette. Let me try. Blush Blush <laughs> Blush Bliss Blush Palette. Tongue twister for reals. So I'm going to use. Actually, I'm gonna just tap it in all of them. I like to mix my blushes and then rosy myself up. So I pat through all of them and I'm gonna just. Make myself look rosy. And then I'm gonna blend it out because this looks like clownish right now, so don't you worry. This is not the final product. I'm gonna go back with the brush I was using and kind of like dust it around and make it more blended in. So you see how intense this side is and more subtle this one is. I go heavy on my blush, so you can put less if you want, but I go heavy because I love blush. Blush is life. It's more blended out now, but I like it more intense because I love blush, but personal preference on how you guys want to do it. So I'm going to go in with this Park Avenue Princess. It's a water proof bronzer. Whoa, okay. When you want to go beach parties, you know, want to look extra dewy. Wow. Look at this product I just pulled out for you. Someone come clean me. And I like to dust it upwards. Don't bring it downwards because the whole purpose of contouring is to snatch your face and you wanna do that by bringing the brush upwards. On my forehead, on my chin. If you have a double chin, get rid of that double chin. That's it for bronzing. Now I'm gonna go back with this rose coconut spray that I have. Or if you wanna be extra dewy, this makes me too dewy, is the MAC Prep and Prime. So I'm gonna spritz myself to set my makeup, make everything go together. For highlight, I'm going in with the one, the only, M. Resi highlight. Ooh, look at that. That looks so beautiful. Wow. And then we're gonna glisten our face. Wow. Just look at that. And then my tip of my nose. Gotta pinch it. Snatch up my nose. Now this side. And the bridge of my brows. My lips and then down the bridge of my nose. I'm gonna go in with the Chloe. No, actually, I want the soft glam. I'm digging the soft glam because I want to be glam, but I want to be soft, you know? That sounded so much. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we're putting um, the tempura. Ooh, tempura. I love sushi. The shade tempura as our base. And I'm gonna pack that baby on, brighten up my lids. So I don't like using foundation before because every time I do it ends up creasing my lids so I just go straight with powder. And I tried the MAC Soft Ochre and that didn't help so this is my routine for my eyes. So I'm going to go in with Dusty Rose as my crease shade, pack that baby on, just back and forth. Kind of like a, a cut crease kind of look but not really. And now I'm going to add some orange soda kind of mix up the atmosphere of my eyes. Light but simple looks, you know? Always the best for summertime. You don't want to go too dark because, you know, 
You want to look nice, natural, glowy. A good alternative for this palette that has similar shades for orange soda and Dusty Rose is the Carly Bible palette. The deluxe one, so the second one that she came out with. That is a really good palette to use for summer looks as well. And it's from BH Cosmetics and it's pretty affordable, so good for those two shades. Gonna go in with orange soda as uh, my under eye shadow. Really smoke that up. Mix it with burnt orange to darken it up. So I'm gonna go with Rustic from that palette and make it a smidge darker. Now I'm gonna go back with Tempera and just brighten up the beginning area. So this is the eye look so far. Now we're gonna quickly do brows because it's looking, looking untamed right now. I'm gonna brush it out with this NYX micro brow pencil and then I'm gonna fill it in. So I'm just gonna do feather like strokes. Some days I go like this without putting mascara because I want that, you know, no makeup makeup look. But then, today is not one of those days, that's for sure. So I'm gonna go in with some mascara. And this is the Better Than Sex Mascara by Too Faced. So we're just gonna plop this on. I love this mascara, it literally makes it look so good. And long and full. So the hype over this mascara is real. My tip on doing mascara is like, I go from the root and twist it up. Do my lower lashes a little bit. You don't want to make them overpowering, but you want to give them some life. Now we're going to go with some lip. I got this mini sample from my Sephora purchase. The Cream Lip Stain by Sephora in the shade in the shade 40, whichever that is. It's a nude shade. I need to make it more pink. So I'm going to grab this Anastasia lip palette and go in with a pinky shade and pack it in the middle. And then I'm gonna go with a hint of white. Oh yeah, looking nice, looking clean, looking fresh. I'm gonna set my face one more time. So this is how I make a nice, clean, simple, summer, everyday look. And it's like dewy, it's glowy, it's popping. Hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, please smash the like button, hit subscribe, and stay tuned for more videos because I'm going to be dropping more. I took a long break, but now I'm back, so if you want to see those videos, then stay tuned. Thank you guys so much for watching, and see you next time.